Imagine a journey through the mysteries and wonders hidden in the world. From the enigmatic miniature coffins of Arthur's seat in Edinburgh to ancient culinary practices discovered in a South African cave, our planet is full of fascinating stories and astonishing discoveries. In this video, we will take you to explore some of the most intriguing and chilling finds found in caves and hidden corners of the earth. Number 1. 17 Miniature Coffins High above Edinburgh's historic old town sits a distinctive and charming landmark, Arthur's Seat, a picturesque volcanic hill. This extraordinary hill transcends mere geology as it is shrouded in an aura of history and mystery that has baffled generations. Some believe it could be King Arthur's Camelot, where legend and reality mix. But the strangest story occurred in June 1836. A group of boys hunting rabbits found something surprising on the northeast slope of Arthur's seat. Seventeen small coffins hidden under thin slate plates. No one knows who was buried there or why. Each coffin was very small, with wooden figures inside that looked like mini dolls. Currently, 17 of these strange coffins are on display at the National Museum of Scotland. There were many theories about its meaning, but it remains a mystery. In 1906, a woman in Edinburgh mentioned that her father had met a deaf man called Mr. B who had drawn something similar to coffins and marked them with years that coincided with people's deaths. Rumors arose as to whether they were related to seafaring superstitions or the murders of Burke and Hare in Edinburgh. Despite all the theories, the seventeen small coffins of Arthur's seat remain an enduring enigma. The hill, once associated with Camelot, is now a place full of mystery, where history, legend and the inexplicable mix to baffle all who explore its secrets. Number 2. 170,000-year-old roasted vegetables. Imagine traveling back in time, not to the era of ferocious mammoths and saber-toothed tigers, but to a South African cave where our ancient ancestors left a culinary secret. In Border Cave, scientists made a surprising discovery. They found charred root vegetables that are a staggering 17,000 years old. This challenges the idea that our prehistoric ancestors were just gross carnivores, as these vegetables were part of their diet. Archaeologists identified these plants as rhizomes of the genus Hypoxus after years of research. These Hypoxus rhizomes had a different flavor and were prized for their starchy qualities. This shows that our ancient ancestors valued a balance in their diet, just like we do. Not all hypoxous rhizomes were the same, and it is likely that they enjoyed a different species, such as Hypoxus andustula, rather than Hypoxus hemorrhoida, which had a bitter taste and was used more for medicinal than culinary purposes. So the next time you eat roasted vegetables, remember that you are following a culinary tradition that has a history of 17,000 years. Number 3. While hiking the rugged trails of New York's Catskill Mountains, two adventurous hikers stumbled upon a disturbing discovery that would haunt their dreams for years. Going far off the beaten path into a secluded cave, their sense of curiosity led them to a chilling encounter. Hidden in a dark corner of the cave, they spotted an enigmatic figure. This was no ordinary statue. It was a wooden effigy with six rusty nails inserted into the eye sockets. To make matters worse, a tight gallows surrounded her neck, hinting at a sinister past. One of the friends, against all sound judgment, could not resist the lure of the voodoo doll and decided to take it home. Little did he know that this decision would soon turn his life into a living nightmare. The moment the figurine entered his home, it began to show a disturbing life of its own. Muddy footprints appeared mysteriously on their floors and a putrid stench permeated the air. The situation escalated to the point where loud, inexplicable knocks would wake him up in the middle of the night and ghostly knocks would echo on his front door, even though no one was ever there. Terrified for his life, 
The hiker realized that he was dealing with an artifact that harbored malevolent forces beyond comprehension. Desperate to get rid of this cursed object, he entrusted it to a local museum in hopes of breaking the sinister connection that had been forged. This cautionary tale serves as a chilling reminder. You should never, under any circumstances, bring strange and disturbing objects found in caves into your home. You never know what malevolent entities they may harbor, especially if they carry symbols of torment like rusty nails and a tight gallows. Such objects are harbingers of nothing but darkness and despair. This is a pretty scary warning, and the next discovery could herald an even scarier story. Number 4. Earlier this year, from the hidden corners of Hollowell Cave in the heart of Germany, a wonderful artifact emerged from the sheltering earth, a small, exquisite sculpture of a bird carved from ancient mammoth tusks. What made this avian masterpiece truly extraordinary was its astonishing age, exceeding 30,000 years. This finely chiseled work of art served as a portal to the mysterious world of shamanism. Imagine an aquatic bird adorned with a horse's head and a magnificent lion's mane, a fantastic and inspiring creature in the realm of shamanic practice. Birds, especially waterfowl, held a revered place as symbols of great significance. This humble carving reinforces the belief that birds played a fundamental role in the spiritual life of early humans. The bird's head, eyes and graceful outstretched neck bring the ancient ivory to life, making it appear almost capable of taking flight. The artist behind this masterpiece, whose name has been lost to the sands of time, would surely swell with pride knowing that his creation now holds the title of the oldest known bird depiction in human history. However, this remarkable bird was not alone in its former artistic prowess. In a hidden cave in the heart of the French jungle, a figurine of an owl stood as his silent companion. Although reminiscent of the cave paintings attributed to our rugged Neanderthal cousins, Research revealed that these treasures were the work of early modern humans. Carbon dating revealed their astonishing age, meticulously carved between 28,000 and 35,000 years ago. Number 5. Translucent Snails In the mysterious depths of the Lukaina Jamatro Jama cave system in Croatia, a brave team of cavers and intrepid biologists stumbled upon a revelation like no other. As they ventured into the abyss of one of the world's deepest caves, ranked among the top 20 on Earth, their search was far from ordinary. These explorers set out on a journey that would reveal an astonishing secret hidden 3,200 feet below the surface. In their relentless search for the unknown, this daring team discovered an unprecedented species of snail. However, these were no simple garden snails, they were creatures of wonder and peculiarity, translucent beings belonging to the genus Siam. Throughout their dangerous odyssey, as they diligently collected biological specimens, their eyes met the tiny shape of a snail unlike any other documented in the annals of science. Nicknamed Siam though Sam, this amazing creature defied conventional snail norms. It carried a luminous dome-shaped shell that looked like a work of art created by nature itself. These extraordinary snails moved at an almost glacial pace, advancing just millimeters or centimeters each week, often stuck in circular paths. Their leisurely existence reflected their comfortable home in the cave, where they grazed peacefully. When these astonishing discoveries came to the keen eye of taxonomist Alexander Wiend in Germany, his verdict was unequivocal. A virgin species previously unknown to science had been revealed. As these intrepid explorers and biologists looked deeper into the heart of our planet, they discovered a world until then hidden from human understanding. But what do you think would be found inside a cave closed for five million years, completely isolated from the outside world? Dinosaurs, prehistoric insects, extraterrestrial life? Nobody knew until Dr. Christian Lasca in Romania managed to open the cave after 5.5 million years. 
Movo Cave in Romania has remained isolated from the outside world for millions of years. A limestone rock blocked the cave entrance at the same period when our prehistoric ancestors were beginning to evolve into humans. When scientists finally opened it in the 21st century, they discovered that the inhabitants of Movo Cave are truly unique. This cave in Romania has been sealed for millions of years, creating unique conditions inside. Although toxic and oppressive, researchers consider it a treasure. Fewer than 100 people have entered the cave since its discovery in 1986. It is protected by limestone shafts and tunnels, and can currently only be accessed with special permission. The air inside has low oxygen content and high levels of carbon dioxide and hydrogen sulfide. There is no sunlight and the temperature is 77 degrees Fahrenheit. The smell of rotten eggs indicates the presence of hydrogen sulfide, which is extremely lethal. The cave has allowed extraordinary life to flourish, including chemosynthetic bacteria that could help tackle greenhouse gases. Most of the cave's inhabitants are blind and colorblind. They don't need sight or beauty in complete darkness. They are thin, with long legs and antennas to orient themselves in the dark. The presence of chemosynthetic microbes makes them look like aliens. Instead of photosynthesis, they obtain energy and carbon through chemical reactions, such as the oxidation of sulfur or ammonium. It is not known how the animals got to the cave or how they became trapped there. There are 48 different species, including spiders, scorpions, and centipedes. Surprisingly, 33 of them are unique to this cave and are not found anywhere else on Earth. They have been there longer than humans have existed, but their discovery was delayed due to isolation in the closed cave. Most of the creatures in the cave are blind and lack pigmentation. They have developed antennae and long limbs to move without relying on sight. They are unlike anything we have seen before in an environment without sunlight. The evolution in this place seems strange. The area has a unique ecosystem that takes advantage of the dangerous gases in the cave. Some species can thrive on these gases, although we cannot survive on them. Bacteria perform chemosynthesis, converting harmful gases into food. This chemical process provides energy and food to these bacteria, similar to photosynthesis in plants. Smaller organisms feed on bacteria and are then consumed by larger animals, such as scorpions and spiders. In turn, worms, shrimp and other small creatures feed on the bacteria. This self-sustaining life cycle allows everything in the cave to live and thrive. Movo Cave is a unique environment on dry land, similar to environments found in the deep ocean near hydrothermal vents. Researchers have had access to this cave for many years and hope to obtain new data on evolution. Although experts still don't understand how the animals got to the cave, some bacteria are thought to have been there for much longer than 5 million years, while other animals may have fallen in accidentally before the cave was sealed. These animals have adapted to survive with the limited resources available. More than 50 species have been discovered in the cave, including poisonous and predatory insects such as the centipede. Although scientists have known about the cave for a long time, much remains to be discovered and the new finds are expected to offer valuable insights into evolution and life itself. Israeli scientists discovered an ancient ecosystem in an underground cave near the town of Ramli. This cave, located 328 feet underground in a limestone quarry, has been protected from the outside world for millions of years. Eight previously unknown species were found there, including crustaceans and invertebrates that resemble scorpions and shrimp. The cave ecosystem is special and secluded, with passages stretching for approximately 1.5 miles. The discovery highlights our lack of knowledge about life on our planet and the importance of continued research. The creatures in the cave have been protected by a layer of chalk impervious to water and external nutrients. 
These species depend on a self-sufficient and independent ecosystem, in contrast to animals that depend on the photosynthetic food chain. Although there are other similar caves in Mexico and Romania, none are as remote as this Israeli cave. The Rising Star Cave system in South Africa has revealed discoveries that challenge our ideas about human evolution. Before the first signs of burial by modern humans, evidence was found that an ancient and mysterious human species buried their dead and left carvings on cave walls. This suggests that these behaviors were not exclusive to the more intelligent Homo sapiens and Neanderthals, as previously believed. In 2013, during excavations in the Rising Star Cave system in South Africa, the first fossils of Homo nality were discovered. These caves are part of a UNESCO World Heritage Site that is considered the birthplace of humanity. In this region, researchers have found fossils of several species of early human ancestors, contributing to our understanding of the history of human evolution. Dr. Lee Berger a paleoanthropologist and National Geographic explorer in residence, has led a team of explorers in investigating vast and dangerous cave systems. Their goal is to learn more about extinct hominins and early human ancestors. Recently, the team made a significant discovery, skeletons of adult and juvenile homo nality that were preserved in the fetal position in depressions in the cave floors. These burials date back at least 100,000 years before known Homo sapiens burials. During exploration of the tombs in the cave, markings were found on the walls, including geometric designs and cross lines similar to hashtags. These marks are estimated to be between 241 and 335,000 years old, although more testing is required to confirm their exact age. Homo nality has been found to have practiced intentional burials, used symbols, and engaged in meaning-related activities. These findings suggest that these early human ancestors were involved in sophisticated rituals associated with death, indicating that symbolic behaviors are not unique to humans and may not be novel. Homo nality were characterized by having smaller heads, shorter statures, and a more robust build than humans but they also walked upright and used their hands to manipulate objects. Numerous Homo nality fossils have been discovered in the caves, including adults and newborns, providing information about their population. Furthermore, Homo nality was observed to be very familiar with the cave system and used it extensively. The theory that this species intentionally deposited its dead in caves was controversial due to the size of its brain and has been widely discussed. In 2018, researchers discovered that Homo nality deliberately buried their dead in oval holes in the cave. They found bodies rolled up in tombs carved into horizontal slopes, showing they were not transported accidentally. The bodies were completely covered in soil before decomposing, showing that they were buried as complete human entities. They also found carvings on the wall, and a tool buried next to an adult homo nality. The walls of the cave had geometric engravings made in dolomite, a very resistant rock. There is no evidence that humans have been in the caves, suggesting that homo nality made the engravings. Additionally, homo nality used fire inside the caves, as evidenced by the soot, charcoal, and burned bones found in them. Homo nality symbols and burials suggest significant behaviors, but researchers are unsure of their meaning or whether they served as a form of interspecies communication. Several species, including Homo nality, Homo sapiens, Neanderthals, and Denisovans, engaged in behaviors previously thought to be unique to humans. This challenges our ideas about when hominins began using fire, creating meaning, and burying their dead. Researchers continue to study Homo nality to learn more about its age, relationship to humans, and the possibility of finding DNA in bones found in caves.